everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today I'm just going to do a makeup look using some products that I have in my makeup collection and also products I've received in recent BoxyCharm boxes. So I've already put foundation on my face. So let's just jump right in and we'll go ahead and bronze up the face a little. So I'm going to be going in with this Kenya this Kenya Antiveros bronzer. This is the palette right here. And we we received this in our maybe July boxy charm. It could have been June or July. that out a little better and sometimes if your if your bronzer goes on a little too dark you can just take your foundation brush and just go over it a little and that'll help mute the color a little bit if you accidentally put too much on next I'm just gonna go in with I don't believe I've used this yet on my channel but it's possible that I have we'll use the studio makeup eyeshadow palette this came in one of the boxy charm boxes as well and this is what that looks like it has some beautiful colors so let's just go in with a this is the JH 34 eyeshadow brush and first I'll just go in with this color lace that'll just be a good transition color And for today's look, I think I do something like with pinks and lavenders maybe. To maybe match the background a little. So next, I'm just going to go in with this dust color right here. Now I did not put on an eyeshadow primer, but I am having to put a good bit of product on the brush for this to show up some. Let's try another brush. This is the JH40 brush, the Morphe. I'm going to go in with that brush and see if maybe this packs some color a little better. Next, I'm going to go in with the blush color. It's a lavender shade. And I'm just putting that on my lid and also in my crease area. Kind of just blending it all together. And I'm just going to go on with the dusk and blush color on my lower lash line. Next, I'm just going to put on a little bit of lipstick just to add a little color. And today, let's go on with the, um, this is the little Tristique lipsticks we received. Now, this we received in the August boxes. I'm going to go on with, this color is called Florence Fig. And it's like a nude color. It's very pretty.
It has a little bit of brown. It's a beautiful color. Now let's finish the eyes up. For mascara. I may have used this mascara in my last video. I can't remember, but I believe I did. I'm going in with the Wonder Beauty Mile High Club Mascara. This is a very good mascara. And we did receive this in a boxy charm box as well. It may have been June. What are some things that y'all are doing that you and your family enjoy doing right now? I know a lot of stuff is still closed, but... And the more I use this mascara, the more I love it. It's, I love how it separates and it makes your lashes very black. And it also lengthens them as well. Okay, now I'm also going to be going in with, and I know I've used this product before as well. I'm going to be going in with the Hourglass Brow Pencil, and this is called Soft Brunette. I would highly suggest everyone to try this. It's a very good, very good um, brow pencil. It's got a very good formulation, and it's not so pigmented that it very quickly gets out of hand on you it's very buildable and that's what I love about it now just brush that out some so it'll blend better. And like I said, um, these products um, that I'm using, it's possible I've used some of them already. And lastly, I'll be going in with this Eleven Blush Palette. I've been having this for a while. I actually got this at Forever 21 a few years ago, and I love this palette. I think it's very good. And of course, with it being from Forever 21, it wasn't overpriced but it's a very good product i'm just going to go in with the baddington brush that we got in one of our boxy charm boxes and i'm just going to go in with this color and a little bit of this color and i love these blushes they're so good I'm not sure if you can get them anymore, but hopefully you were able to get one while they had them. I haven't seen a lot of makeup at our Forever 21 in a while. I don't go to them too often, and especially with the COVID, we don't go in the malls right now much at all. But whenever they were open, I didn't really ever see the makeup there anymore. They had like miscellaneous things by the checkouts. But I didn't really see a lot of makeup anymore, and that's a shame because I know that I got a few blush palettes, and I know those palettes worked very good, and they were all this Love & Beauty um, brand that made them. The palettes, the blush palettes I got was by them. So let's go in and add a little bit of highlight, and for that, I'm just going to go in with this. It's actually called Highlight in this palette right here, and to do that, I'm going to go in with this JH. 32 brush and you can definitely tell that this highlighter has some payoff on it oh, peachy gold color so I just wanted to film a little video for you guys and I hope you're having a great night and I hope you're having a great day or a great night I hope you're staying safe let me know what you guys are doing to pass some time during these times we're having right now. And if you have any thoughts or any products you'd like me to review on my next pro on my next video, please just let me know in the description down below. And thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.